it's, it's like it's a, it's for two days but like it's all just community stuff and for the one hour they did reveal shit it was like re it was remasters of everything it was so bad dude oh my god really so you know how they totally failed warcraft 3 reforged or whatever uh, next oh, is diablo 2 oh. resurrection <laughs> but it looks good Come but on. it's gonna be shitty dude and for hearthstone you don't play hearthstone anymore huh no uh, they're coming what? out with like, oh, we're gonna the core Expansion. sets back. We're gonna you can play the game just like it originally launched. It's like it wasn't even that long ago. What? I know. And they're like, we're what changing the up the core set. Now? You can get Leroy Jenkins un unnerfed. Oh, it's, it's so dumb, dude. It was just, it's just ridiculous. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah. All right, I'm not talking to them anymore, but I might as well rant about the rest of this. So the the, the freaking Blizzard thing, it was Come just. They're a big company now, like a huge, huge company, and they lost a lot of faith for gamers. Um, and the whole presentation, it was it was just for like an hour for the reveals. The whole thing was like at least ten minutes at the beginning of pure pandering, uh -huh. trying to get people's hey, trust back. The um, so they were pretty much saying, "Oh yeah, we're we're you know, we remember these old games. You remember old school Warcraft. You remember WoW, how you met your husband in WoW." Remember old Diablo? Remember old Hearthstone? There was a lot of rehashing the game, the old games, and trying to make them seem like a big community company. And, dude, we all know that they're just bowing down and sucking China's dick right now. So, I mean, it, it's true. Like, we're not going to deny it. It's true. Like, you know, with the past decisions of the movies they've made and the games they've made, it just... Everything that they were showing during that whole Blizzard conference felt so disingenuous it just i hated it i hated it so much i was actually going to make a full oh, dedicated dog, video man. watching it and reacting to it and giving my thoughts oh my God, but i was 15 it, minutes in and i'm like i don't want to talk about any of this so i turned it off but here i am talking about it but it's like after the fact and i'm like okay i'll say a little bit about it so it's just i don't know dude. blizzard is not the same it's definitely not the same as it used to be man <sighs> It was like no good announcements. There was only a couple of, oh my God. you know, remaster news and all of it. And from here on, it's like a little bit of updates of the things that they did announce. And I think the only thing I'm excited about, honestly, Diablo 4 is the only thing I'm going to play for them. I'm not going to play WoW. I'm not going to play Hearthstone. I'm not going to play Overwatch or anything like that. I, think I, I don't think they're even do touching it. StarCraft anymore, at least for not for a while. Um, but so yeah, Diablo 4 is the only thing I'm going to touch. But honestly, everything else is so... Oh, like, I can't believe it, man. Like, they're, they're really trying so hard. Like, they didn't even, you know how bad it is? They didn't even mention World of Warcraft Reforged at all. They were like, oh, yeah, check out this remaster, just like we did really good with the StarCraft one or something like that. It was so bad, dude. So you can watch yourself. It's called the Blizzard Opening Ceremonies. You guys should go watch it, dude. It's just like, I don't know. I'm going to try and put some vision like, It's like how many hours? It's like seven hours after the presentation. I'm still feeling this way, you know? It's just, it felt really just in genuine. Like, they're really trying to get public opinion back to positive. But it's just not. I mean, a lot of people are going to fall for it. I mean, people are quick to forget a lot of the blunders that they did. You know, a lot of people just don't support the company anymore because of decisions from the community. Um, like, pushing people out because, you know, LGBTQ, stuff like that. It's, it's really interesting. And I'm not going to go into specific details on a lot of cases, but it's rough. It's really rough. So, yeah. Uh, that's what I gotta say about Blizzard, man. I mean, I'll play Diablo 4, and if they ever come out with a new IP, I will try it out. But as a huge company themselves, they're not fooling me, dude. They're not fooling me. They're a huge ass company. You know, the bottom dollar is is all it is, is, is all it is for them, and that's just what it is. So. Fucking Zeus, man.